Hello everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Core. Today I am going to show you online birth certification system in ASP.NET Core. How to design online birth certificate in online uh, using simple uh, filling details. So in which we have only two uh, module that is a user module and the admin module and uh, uh, you have to say that in uh, in uh, ASP.NET Core we have only two uh, roles uh, that is the user role and the admin role. So the first of all, uh, I'm going to show you uh, user uh, role. So uh, a user can uh, sign up into your account if they uh, if don't have an account. So, and uh, using uh, mobile number and the password, you have to got a login screen. You have to log in into the accounts. So uh, filling that form uh, by the user that is the first name, last name, mobile number, address and passwords. That uh, thing uh, will uh, not design because uh, identity um, uh, automatically provide that uh, things. But first name and the last name is not provided by the identity user. So must to add uh, inside your application uh, user class. Uh, if you don't know, then check my second video tutorial of that birth certification system. Uh, I will show you how to do this. Okay, S just after signing into, into the accounts uh, by the user, uh, the user can change their profile like the uh, like that type of module will uh, show to change the profile like first name, last name, mobile number, address, registration date, and uh, that thing, and also change the password. That thing is already provided by the Microsoft Identity uh, Server. So current password new password and the confirmed password is uh, uh, text boxes is there on on your uh, model pop-up okay that thing is the new in uh, uh, birth certification system that is the date of birth gender full name place of birth full name of the father that is the important thing in a certificate system anyone can fill uh, their child uh, uh, details in uh, by that form okay so date of the birth gender full name place of the birth full name of the father permanent address postal address contact number and email so after filling that form a user can click on the add details that the whole details will pass from the view to control section and controller post action method cache that details in in the section of the view model and the view model will pass that detail into the model and uh, the details will fill into the database table the default action and the default status of that application is the pending and action is related to the view of by the user so when we click on the view uh, of the status that is pending the default that type of a screen will appear uh, to the user that is the user detail application number application details that is things uh, will show um, okay now that uh, thing is used by the admin username and the password and a forget password is also there and uh, when we click on the login but button admin can uh, enter into the dashboard that is where you can check the total new application total new application that is view one view detailed total rejected application is there okay so um, uh, birth uh, inside the navigation menu birth applications uh, and dates reports and uh, all application reports searches there and uh, admin can check all the details by their search and uh, list of uh, listed their uh, uh, table so application number name mobile number father status and action the default action is the status and uh, admin can edit their status by checking the view section when application checked by the admin uh, that type of application will show like the name of the uh, name of the child on uh, date of birth um, and uh, place of birth permanent address mobile number after verifications uh, after verified uh, that application by manually to the uh, admin uh, or, or you can say the police verifications like uh, and uh, and any other uh, uh, details so after uh, status will changed by the admin that is the verified and uh, pending something like 
and uh, also that application will search uh, by their uh, old applications also and uh, search facility is there by uh, to the admin that is search uh, by application number and if any inquiry uh, will occurs uh, to the admin that and then mm, on that time uh, admin can use that facility search by application number and the search result will uh, show in that table uh, like status verified actions show uh, okay so uh, that facility uh, uh, done by the admin uh, and uh, admin can change their profile uh, also and forget password is also so this thing is doing in asp.net core so this is the first tutorial that is the prototype of the project and i will uh, design uh, in the latter video session uh, one by one I, I will show you how to do and how to design this uh, birth certification system in ESP.NET Core. Thank you very much.